you know, yeah. to put that in perspective, Pearl Harbor was bombed on November, on December seventh, nineteen forty one, right? Mm-hmm. So this is already after we had gotten involved in the war. Yes. Okay, and you were in Mississippi at the time? And when the war broke out? Yeah. No, it's... I was stationed at Fort Sam Houston. I hadn't gone on this cadre oh, yet. Okay. Mm-hmm. And at the time of the war, the Jap- Japanese bl- uh, bombed Pearl Harbor, I was at Fort Sill, Oklahoma, mm-hmm. going to a artillery survey school, and the our battalion had gone up to Fort Sill to, I was in the 12th Field Artillery Battalion, a 155 millimeter howitzer battalion. And the school, we had gone up there, the battalion had gone up there to uh, fire for the officers, uh, artillery officer school there at Fort Sill. And the, during the time the battalion was up there, they sent me to the survey school. Mm-hmm. So uh, when the Japs attacked at Pearl Harbor, uh, two days later we loaded up and went back to Fort Sam Houston, Texas to join the division. We convoyed in trucks uh, back to Fort Sam Houston, Texas. And, and that was uh, must have been about the ninth of ninth and tenth of December when we went back. Well, in uh, the following March, then I went on the cadre to uh, Camp Shelby, Mississippi, mm-hmm. to activate the 85th Infantry Division. And then you came back in November. I came back in November of 1942, and and that's when we got married. And uh, we got married on that 15-day leave, and we went back then to Camp Shelby. Were you making arrangements for this via the the mail or something, or no? Did you come back and mm-hmm. just kind of on the We'd spur been of the moment. We'd been writing each other, and then he came down. I'd moved to Corpus Christi. Uh huh. So he came down to Corpus Christi. When did you decide that you were going to get married then? On a uh, on a Wednesday Wednesday night. On a Wednesday night. <laughs> on a Wednesday night. We couldn't get the license the next day because it was Thanksgiving. <laughs> and uh, we got the license on Friday. Friday. Mm-hmm. And uh, married yeah. Friday night, November twenty seventh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So then, uh, then what happened? You went. Uh, you were still at uh, Sam Sam Houston, right? No, or Sam I, U- no, I was at Camp Show in Mississippi. Oh, you were still there. You came back in November. Came back on a 15-day leave. Right. Oh, and I we see. went back Camp Show. Well, she stayed in in Corpus until I got back to Hattiesburg, Mississippi, is where mm-hmm. Camp Shelby is located. Mm-hmm. And I found a little upstairs apartment. It was kind of like an attic apartment. Uh, it was on the second, was it second or third floor? Second, second floor. floor. In a house there? Yeah. In a house there in Actually, in just a room because we didn't have any cooking facilities we had to eat out. Uh-huh. Well, we had uh, privileges for using the kitchen, but we didn't. We, ate out and she got there uh, did you get there well, you didn't get did you get there before Christmas mm-hmm. she got there about three or four weeks after I got back mm-hmm. you remember how much you were making back then and how much that apartment cost you <laughs> no uh well, when we got married, I was first sergeant, and I think my base pay at that time was a hundred and hundred and thirty-eight dollars a month, plus uh, quarters and yeah. and uh, rations. So uh, I was making a total of uh, uh, neighborhood of one hundred and seventy-five, one hundred and eighty dollars a month. Yeah. 
that was it. So you're in Mississippi, and uh, it's Christmas in 1942. Then, then when did you uh, get uh, activated or whatever you call it, and, and uh, take off to Europe? Well, from from uh, Hattiesburg, Mississippi, we were going on uh, maneuvers to Louisiana. Mm -hmm. And uh, so Alice had to take the bus back to Corpus Christi, Texas. I could have stayed there, I suppose. And I went had the place. Yeah. Well, I wasn't coming back because uh, we were going to Louisiana maneuvers, and, and from there we were not returning mm -hmm. to Camp Shelby. Mm -hmm. So she went back to Corpus Christi, Texas, and I went on Louisiana maneuvers, which lasted for a month or something like that. Then from the Louisiana Maneuvers, uh, we went, the division went by train to uh, Southern California to take part in desert training. Mm -hmm. And uh, we first uh, arrived uh, uh, at a camp just beyond Yuma, Arizona in California we called it Camp Pilot Knob, but what it, what it, uh, there's a little mountain out there they call Pilot Knob, and this was camp was located in the desert there near this mountain, so it was named Camp Pilot Knob, and it was we pitched tents out there. And that, that was type camp, it was just temporary yeah. camp, and we were there. We got there and early June, the first, about the first part of June, I guess, and uh, I got a 15-day leave and left, uh, caught a train out of Yuma the 4th of July, mm -hmm. came back to Texas, and uh, we spent the leave in Texas, and then Alice went back with me, and uh, we've went to El Centro, California, where we got an apartment, and and I returned then to Camp Pilot Knob, mm -hmm. and we were commuting back and forth. It was 49 miles each way. Uh, we, uh, I was commuting back and forth whenever we could get off. Yeah. Of course, we were out there for training, so sometimes it was... Uh, Week, a week at a time that uh, we'd be in the field and wouldn't, if I wouldn't get back. When when you were in Corpus, Corpus Mom, what, what were you doing there? Were you doing anything memorable? Were you working somewhere? Or? No, I was going to school. You were going to school? Where? Corpus Christi High School. Oh, you were still mm -hmm. in high school. Yeah. That's right, because mm -hmm. you're only 17 at this mm -hmm. point, right? So, you were going to Corpus Christi High School, and then did you graduate that year? Mm-mm. You were junior? Mm-hmm. And then you went to El Centro after that junior year? Mm -hmm. Okay. How long were you out in El Centro? Well, we were at Pilot Knob for a short period of time after... Alice got out to El Centro, and then they moved us to Camp Coxcomb, which was uh, 100 and, I think it was about 110 miles from El Centro. So we only got to come home on the weekends then. And in October, uh, we packed up to, and was rode the train to Fort Dix, New Jersey. That is, the the division did. Mm -hmm. Alice went back to Corpus Christi on by bus. Yeah. And uh, went to Fort Dix, New Jersey, and we were going to be there for a little while. We arrived in October, latter part of October, I guess. 